anything. Artist. We're chatting. Can demo this. I'll be here. Rage against the machine. Smashing pumpkins. <laughs> or the hives. The hives. The hives. HTCS 620 or the T-Mobile Dash. Now, let me just talk you through a scenario. How many of you have ever been just with your mobile device and someone sends you a link to a SharePoint or to a file share? And the, the email normally goes along the lines of, uh, oh, Jason, sorry for the short notice, or it says in brackets, fire drill, um, but this is really important and I really need your feedback by the end of the day. How many of you ever had an email like that? Oh, normally everyone. So, so one of the challenges if you have a mobile device and that document is stored internally is you can't get access to it. And on one hand, we're encouraging people from an administration, from an IT perspective, not to send around massive attachments and put them on SharePoint sites. We then equip them with a mobile device and they can't get access to anything that's on a SharePoint site. So what we've actually done in Windows Mobile 6, and this is, uh, also requires Exchange 2007, is uh, we've provided uh, something called mobile document access. Now what this means is that with mobile document access, I actually have the ability to access any internal SharePoint or UNC file path without needing a VPN. So let me go ahead and give you an example here. So I'm just putting John. So I'll show you the smart filtering we have in email where I can quickly go to an email message. If I click on here, I can see that John sent me some new Windows Mobile 6 documents. Now, he's not actually attached them but what he's done is he's actually put them as uh, links. So he's got a file share link in here. He's also put in um, some SharePoint links. Now, ordinarily, I just wouldn't be able to access those. I'd have to wait until I got to my PC or I'd have to have a VPN. So if I just click on here, this is uh, this file, and if I show you the full URL, it's on my file share, so it's a public folder, what's new with well, what, what. If I click yes, what this will do is it will use Exchange. It will proxy that connection through to the file share and it will check my permissions on it, and it will give me the option then to open it. So he can say, download the 62.5k file. If I say yes, it will then open it in Word. So this gives me the ability to access any internal document, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, natively from my device without needing a VPN. And one of the things within Windows Mobile 6 is that we've now added support for Word, Excel, and PowerPoint across all devices. Previously, you had to have a pocket PC or what's now called a professional device to have Office Mobile. So we now have it across all devices, and we can see it's uh, downloading a little slowly here over the Edge network. But um, you'll see it pop up now in Word Mobile. So many people clap at that point because they're quite impressed. <laughs> <laughs> no VPN, no net. So here you go, this is the document that we read through here. You know, and you see the scroll, fast scrolling we have here, and what we've actually got is some flow and control. Uh, and I can see all of the images, uh, all of the tables that are available here. We've got word wrap set, and you know, I can go ahead and scroll down here and read the whole document. I go ahead and make changes, I can send it on to someone straight from my device. You know, I haven't got to wait till I get back to my PC. So that's 